Castro. There I go. Just talk, 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 talk. All about me and my problems. You know what? I want to hear all about you. Please, okay, I... Okay, you know what? Actually, I don't want to hear all about you. I just want to know two things. One, how did you get my cocaine from the police? Hmm? And number two, after you've told me, would you prefer for me to, I don't know, shoot you in the face? Or would you like my compatriot over there to throw you out of that filha da puta da janela? Please, I don't know anything about the police. I'm just a driver. <laughs> I drive for Legacy Investments. I drive, I sit there in the sea. I drive for Legacy Investments. <sighs> Tell me something. How does a driver for Legacy Investments manage to get 10 grams of pure cocaine when Tatiana cannot even get one? It's not yours. It's leftovers. Me and some friends, we were gonna go to this music festival in Cape Town, out in the desert in April. So we all put cash together and we, and, and we bought 30 grams. Oh. From who? I don't know, I didn't buy it. Maybe they even bought it from you. And then lockdown happened and the festival got canceled. So we thought, okay, fine, we'll keep it until next year. But then things got tight, cash-wise. It just got a bit tight, so we thought, why not sell what's left? I swear, I don't know anything about your two kilos or the police. I'm just a driver trying to make some extra money. I mean, I live with my sister and my father. Just trying to make some extra money, I swear. <laughs>